What's happening, guys? Okay, so I'm uh, on my way to Miami from Jacksonville. We're driving down there. I'm not driving. She's driving. And um, what uh, what I'm kind of popping in here and letting you know while we're on the drive is something that I was talking about yesterday with one of my clients. And uh, it kind of it goes with the too good to be true type of uh, spiel. So if you're advertising your product or if you have something that you're trying to push into the marketplace and trying to get attention for, try to not sound so hypey. Now, in the beginning, a lot of times we make this mistake, whether we're, you know, new at writing sales copy or just new in entrepreneurial type of shit, you know, you, you try to hype your stuff up. And when you hype things up, what I think is a little shaky. When you uh, hype things up, it really makes things sound, uh, you know, unbelievable. And when things are unbelievable, people don't buy. So you want to make sure you build trust and you make something sound as uh, logical. You're, you may be selling to the person's emotions, but you want to justify with logic so that after they pay, you know, a hundred dollars for a book, let's say, they're like, yeah, but the book comes in this really amazing cover and it was shipped overnight. And, you know, all these logical reasons that they could tell their friends if their friends are like, you bought a hundred dollar book? Well, in your sales copy, always ask yourself, um, when my customer buys this, what's the logical reason that they're gonna say they purchased this for? I mean, they're not gonna say, I bought this dating book because I feel so depressed that I need to, you know, find myself and, um, you know, I want all these internal things. They're not gonna actually admit that in real life. They, they may buy because of that, but um, they'll say because, you know, I can get a girl's number or something and that's really cool. You know, all I had to do was buy this book, you know, some shit like that. So you want to justify with logic, but sell it to their emotion and also make your stuff sound as non hypey as possible. And one of the quick tips to do that is if you're starting, uh, you know, copywriting or writing your own stuff is uh, take out a lot of adjectives from what you're saying and that'll kind of make your copy flow better and help you out. So that's a quick tip. I don't want to keep on going. I'll uh, see you guys in Miami. Ciao.